其实这次呢，也没有特别有破秒的活动，就是因为我们的受邀，呃，艾瑞斯请我们来协助麦克他做一些他们电脑的测试。那因为他这次来呢，我们也有准备了一些，就是协助他们做测试的一个轮胎，就是我们的光头胎。那光头胎呢，就是大家比较陌生的尺寸，就是我们讲的大光头。哦，前轮是一二五七零十七，那后轮是两百六五十七。麦克在 s u p e r b i k e 他就是习惯了这个尺寸，所以我们就准备这个尺寸给他。胶质的部分呢，我们前轮准备了 SC One， 哦，那后轮呢准备了 SC One 跟 SC X。那这两个呢，都是麦克在 s u p e r b i k e 最常使用的胶质。I've been riding on Pirelli tyres for for many many years now. My first initial impression of them was they are a very high quality and a high performance tyre. They've always provided exceptional levels of grip、um, for you to be able to go really fast and have a lot of confidence. Over the years that I've been riding with Pirelli and their develop their tyre has been developing, I feel like that performance has always stayed there. But they've also increased their their durability, like their longevity of the tyre. So not only do you get performance, but you also get、uh, the the duration of the tyre. So you can go for a longer distance and and have the consistency with the tyre over a longer period of time. We know that Superbike race is a four-wheel race, not like MotoGP. It's a four-wheel race. It's a development race. 那你所有的车辆啊，所有的马力值其实比较不符合在路上使用。我们贝亚利有个 slogan， 就是我们卖的就是我们比赛的，那我们比赛就是我们卖的。新开发的 Super Corsa 的 V4 啦，像 s p o r Corsa 啦，其实它就有很多很多的赛车元素在里面。今天的胎压设定，其实我觉得当天的温度其实蛮有趣的。早上其实温度不高，那早上低温量起来大概才三十一到三十五度左右。那我们早上的胎压设定呢，其实前轮是设定热胎压三十四，好，那后轮是二十六。那其实这样子骑下来的小效果跟反应，其实以麦克来说已经很不错了。那因为下午的时候呢，温度升高，那下午的低温来到了大概是四十八度、五十度左右，所以说我们把后轮的胎压降低成二十四。Yeah. The, the pressure is not going too high. Yeah, maybe. I think that、uh, in the beginning of the day, I was a little bit concerned whether it would be possible to to break the lap record because I feel like the lap time is quite fast. I think the most difficult corner at Lee Power Circuit is turn 15 and turn 16 because there is a little bit of an elevation change. It's very tight. You have to try to shift the gear whilst also changing direction with the bike. This makes it quite the challenge. Once you enter turn 16, you have a lot of lean angle, and you have to be very careful with the throttle not to spin the rear tire too much. Also, because I I'm not very familiar with the with the circuit, like it was only my second time riding there, so we also only had a few short sessions, you know, three sessions to ride.、Uh, so for sure, I was a little bit concerned whether it would be possible to break the record. Can you pick up turn four? The way I want to push away, so not enough. Not enough push for the rear tire onto the ground, and for acceleration, all corners, acceleration, lots of wheel spin. I want to spin a lot. Yeah, yeah, too much. Straight on the street. Also coming on the street. Yeah.
first time riding Lipau circuit with the 23 corners. It was very enjoyable, but it was a lot to remember. It's quite a long circuit and has a variety of different styles of corners. So it was, um, yeah, very, very enjoyable and very challenging.在一切都在我们的意料之中那麦克其实他对贝亚利的产品Really good. Uh, even yeah, yeah. Because when I first start the, the riding, I need to feel how much grip you have, and each lap I'm learning, learning, learning. So uh, I get a bit faster and a bit faster each time. But the, I was quite surprised at how long it lasted because I thought it would maybe only last, you know, maybe two two laps, but it kept going. So yeah, it was good. Really good. Yeah, yeah. very happy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lucky that you tell me to come in, because otherwise... Yeah. <laughs> keep going. <laughs> so. I think for people who are new to the circuit, it's their first time riding at Lipau. Uh, the most important thing is for them to learn learn the circuit because the, there is 23 corners. It's a very very long track. Uh, it's quite difficult to remember everything. So I think that they should just mostly focus on trying to remember all of the turns and um, and then focus probably on getting the lines correct for for, for each corner. Uh, it's good to take things calm and steady in the beginning and work work to build some uh, confidence once they feel comfortable.
今年所发表的 V4， 其实它就是一条应该说是一个有纹的光头胎。那它比 V3 其实有很大很大的进步。第一就是它的胎洗已经完全跟光头胎是一模一样的。那这 SP 的版本呢，其实在五十波 Cosa 的这个产品产品线里面，其实是非常久的一个产品。可是我们今年才引进，因为今年的 SP 真的很厉害。它除了复合胶质之外呢，还有我们 Russell f o r Cosa 所使用 A B C 底胶。它这个底胶呢，它可以因为这个轮胎温度的一个改变，而改变这个胶质的这个软硬度。所以 V4 S P 呢，才是我们今年的一个销售的主力厂商。非常热血的一个赛道玩家，当然还是主打我们的 V4 那 S C 的部分。我相信可以让它在赛道上骑得非常的愉快，非常的开心。一般的业余型玩家，那偶尔去报一下赛道日，那这个部分呢，其实就非常建议我们的 V4 S P， 因为 V4 S P 呢，它的速度等级是到两百七的 W 等级。如果你在赛道场可以使用之外，偶尔去山路、去西滨、去那种快速道路，你都可以有效的被使用。The feeling is great coming to Taiwan and riding the riding these circuits, and of course setting the the lap records. It's it's a great feeling. I think though that it's just great to share the the passion of、uh, motorcycle riding and and show the people here in Taiwan、um, what it's capable of at at these circuits. So it's just been for me. It's just a lot of fun, and I, I really enjoy riding here.